Hello and welcome to Tech Baffle. How was your day today? Let me know in the comment section. 16,034 fragments. Absolutely crazy. Today I'm going to show you how you can defragment your hard drive. Now, I'm using this piece of software which not only works for hard drives but also solid state drives as well but what it will do with solid state drives is instead of defragging it will trim the solid state drive instead for more tech goodness don't forget to follow me at tech baffle i'm on facebook twitter instagram and snapchat so the software i'm going to be using today is called smart defrag 5 and it's from the team at iobit you can get a free or pro version of this software i'll go through that in a minute so smart defrag is a reliable and intelligent disk defragmenter with over 7 million users so you can enjoy better pc performance with ultra fast stable efficient defrag engine so you might be thinking well what's the point why do i need to defragment my hard drive what's what does it do? So disk fragmentation is generally the main cause of slow and unstable computer performance. So you might remember when you've got your computer from new and it's all nice and quick, over time it slows down a bit, it's not quite how it was. So that might be down to disk fragmentation. So this software mentions that you can also enjoy faster game launching speed and you can also copy files in half the time. If your files are taking ages to transfer and it's just whirring around, then that's might be why it's taken so long. So if your computer's taken absolutely ages to start up, this is probably why. So it'll, it claims up to 100% faster PC startup. So you'll notice definitely a difference after using this software versus before. So finally, this program offers safe and automatic disk defrag. So you can also leave it in the background and it will automatically work for you with no data loss. So the software gets lots of positive reviews in the media, lots of positive user reviews as well. So it's always a good recommendation. So if you've got the free version, you get basic hard drive defragmentation and optimization. You get no interruptions when working or gaming in silent mode. You get top gaming performance with game optimize. You also get scheduled tasks supported by idle defrag. If you upgrade to the pro version, you get up to 200% faster file access speed. You'll get boot time defragment for faster PC startup. You'll automatically and intelligently defragment fragmented files. You can also customize the defrag mode and disks files to be defragged. With the pro version, it's DMA applied for faster better and stable data transfer. It's also going to update you to the latest version and you'll get the technical support on demand. If you want the free or the pro version, I'll put the links in the description. So let's get started with disk defragmentation. So the program has a really easy to use interface. Basically, it will come out of any hard drives or solid state disks that you have on your computer and it's up to you whether you want to tick them all or just tick some of them. What it will do, it will automatically detect if you've got a hard drive or SSD because for a hard drive you want to defragment it but for an SSD you don't want to but this software knows that what it does instead it trims the SSD if you tick like one hard drive it may take I don't know half an hour or something but if you tick all of your hard drives all at once then it will take a few hours so it's probably better to leave that maybe overnight or something finally you can also optimize Windows apps if you use Windows 10 there's lots of Windows apps involved so once you've selected your hard drives or SSDs, all you have to do next is click Smart Optimize. What it will do now is now analyze all of your hard drives and SSDs. So what you have to do now is basically just sit back and wait for it to do its thing. Because it will take, depending on what hard drive you've got, it might be anything between like half an hour to quite a few hours. It all depends on what kind of storage you have. Also, if you look down here, it also has an option that you can also shut down your computer after it's finished. So if you leave in it, say overnight, you can just tick that and let it run overnight. And when it's finished, it will turn off your computer. So as you can see, it's now complete. So what I've done, I've let Smart Defrag go through all of my hard drives and solid state disks. So on my SSD drive, what it's done, it's trimmed it for better performance. On this hard drive here, it's cleared, or it's defragmented 7,516 fragments. And it's defragmented 116, which is 7.29 gigabytes of files. Here it's defragmented 435 fragments and it's defragmented 15 files which is, seven, which is 17 gigabytes. On local disk 154 and 48, I'll just go through them all. 
new volume 14 and 6. So some of these are partitions, not all of them are hard drives as such, that's why some of them don't have as high results as others. On this external hard drive, it's defragmented 139 fragments and also 1.31 gigabytes of files. And finally, on this hard drive, it's defragmented the most 16,034 fragments and also 49 gigabytes of files, which is 5,634 files, which is absolutely crazy. So what I like about this program is how it tabs each different storage device it's gone through. So it's easy to navigate. You don't have to, like, you can process it all at once and you don't have to do one hard drive at once. You can just let it do its thing of all the hard drives or solid state drives on your computer. So it's really helpful where you can just do all at once and then afterwards you can check each different storage device and you can see what it's done. So yeah, I'm really impressed with that. So this also has different functions. It also has boot time defrag. So what you can do, you can defragment your system files before system startup to maximize the performance of your system. So you can just go ahead and click that on. So once you enable it, you can defragment page files and hibernation files defragment MFT, defragment system files, and then if you've got the pro version, you can also defragment registry files and also defragment specified files, and this basically lets you add certain files. So here you can also optimize your games for better performance, but for me, I've got all my games on a SSD, so I don't need to do this step, but if you store your games on a hard drive, which I'm betting a lot of people do because a lot of games take up a lot of space. If you've got any games on your hard drive, then you can go ahead and optimize it for better gaming performance. So if you click this menu on the top left, you can also go and access your disk health. So it's telling us that the disk health is good, which is always a good sign. It's always good to make sure that your hard drives are running smoothly and that there's not going to be any problems that you might cause a loss of data and finally it's just something a bit of customization if you're interested in that sort of thing you can change the skin from this dark skin to a light skin it just depends on what you like so you can change all the colors if you want to i quite like the dark skin though it looks like other iobit products but i think that's something that i've always recognized of iobit products you can always generally have a light or dark theme on a lot of their things if you like this video don't forget to smash that like button want any more of this sort of thing then don't forget to hit subscribe and ding that bell icon for more tech goodness don't forget to follow me at tech baffle i'm on facebook twitter instagram and snapchat thanks for watching get all the info you need at techbaffle.com yeah.